hello there and welcome back to my youtube channel i am your instructor and in this video series we are going to design this portfolio section and this is gonna be a very short video because this section is a lot easier to design and this will be responsive without any css media query so let me open my code editor and right after this sec section let's have another section with the class of portfolio right and let me copy this and inside that i will have a container div and i will have portfolio underscore container and inside that we will have these heading sections and for this section we have already write the css so let me copy and paste it right here and what will be the text portfolio and people lie work don't okay portfolio or uh, let's have work don't lie let me save and let's have a look and yes we have portfolio and work oh this is misspelled work don't lie and right after this section let's have another section with the class of portfolio underscore content and inside that we will have an image tag or let's have dot portfolio underscore image and inside that i'll have image dot portfolio underscore img and the path will be this uh, inside image and portfolio one and let me copy and paste it three times right and let's change the image to portfolio two and let's change this one as well portfolio three and that's it for the html section let me save and let's have a look yes we have these images let's go to this and let me put folio which will have margin top of tin rim save and let's have a look yes this is working fine let me copy this this class as well and one another class this portfolio img right and yes so for this section we will have margin top of uh, three rim and the display will be grid the grid uh, template columns will be repeat auto fit min max the 35 rem and 1 fr and the grid gap will be let's have 3 rem for now save and yes this is working fine let's go and apply styling with width of 100 percent and height of 35 rem all right and for the image width will be 100 percent height will be 100 percent and the object 
fit property will be cover save and let's have a look and yes this is working so so fine but let me show you the responsiveness for this yes this is completely responsive this is completely responsive all right but let's have the, these rounded corners so for the image i will have border radius of let's have 1.5 frame save and yes this is looking so amazing uh, so that's it for this video and i'll see you in the next video